democracy. That's what they call the sorry state of affairs. Lobbying, disproportionality, the unelected chamber. That goddamn unelected chamber. Wolf, you ever seen true democracy? The chances of that are about as slim as finding a good man in this hellhole we call a city. I came close once, but that was a long time ago. Face it, Shane, it's a lost cause. Maybe we just ain't doing it right. I met a man once, Marv I think was his name. He had a vision. True democracy. A pure democracy. The man's crazy and you know it. Just hear me out, Wolf. Picture this. A unicameral republic system that gives real power to the people. God damn it, Shane, you might be onto something there. Follow me. Too long we've been complaining about this false democracy. The monarchy. It's the principle, Wolf. How do people vote on this democracy of Mars? The way I see it, there's only one way. Single transferable vote. Shame. Each constituency elects one MP, just like usual. The MPs vote to elect the cabinet and put laws forward for the people to decide. You can't just say things like that and get away with it. It's the only way! The only way to combine the fairness of the proportional representation with the accountable constituency system. Uh, got any other bright ideas? Everyone votes. No exception. No mercy. I'm starting to think you're as crazy as Marv. State things you're in? Crazy is starting to sound pretty goddamn good right now. What if they don't want to vote? You know full well the public don't engage in politics anymore. Well, maybe when they have real democracy, They'll feel different. And why would that be? Online referendums for every bill. Mm. But a city with no leader? It would be chaos. It's already chaos, Wolf. Look around you. Besides, the president would act as head of state for emergencies. Let's see. But how do people find time to vote? It's hard enough to get by in this place. Four new days of holiday throughout the year. Specifically for voting. You want me over, Shane? That is real democracy. Did someone say proportional representation? Not again. God damn you, kid. You're a little far from home for us. <laughs>